Hello friends, for opening DMAT account, please make use of the link available in description. Totally we have prepared 10 videos in the fundamental analysis series. This is the 10th video. Watch all these 10 videos one by one so that you can easily understand the concept. Definitely these 10 videos will help you for doing fundamental analysis. Remaining videos link are in description. In this video, I am going to discuss about qualitative analysis. In the previous videos of fundamental analysis series, I had completely discussed about quantitative analysis. In this video, I am going to discuss about qualitative analysis. In this qualitative analysis, two things we have to check. First is quality of the management, that is indirectly their honesty we have to check. Second is capability of the management. For example, let me assume one company. Let me assume that that company had performed well in last 2-3 years and that company's balance sheet, profit and loss account statement, everything is looking good. But if that company's management head is one of the fraud like Vijay Malaya means, better don't invest in that company. Because there is a chance that that company's balance sheet, profit and loss account statement, everything may be fakely created document. That company's promoter might have created that document fake. So, whenever you invest in any company, first you check the quality of the management, that is honesty of the management you check first. At the same time, let me assume one more company, that company is more honest with their shareholders, but that management have less capability. Then better avoid this type of companies also, because from this type of companies you may not get good profit. Always you check both the things, that is whether the company is honest as well as capable. Warren Buffett always will give high importance for the qualitative analysis than quantitative analysis. Because using balance sheet and profit and loss account statement, cash flow statement, we can easily find out how, how the company had performed in the previous year. But using qualitative analysis only, we can able to find out how the company will perform in the future like that. In qualitative analysis, first you should know about the promoter of the company. Any company's promoter name, you can easily find out using Google. For example, in Google, if you search promoter of Britannia Industries Limited means, I will get the name of the Britannia Industries Limited promoter and other details about the promoter. Next step, you have to check the honesty of that company. For that, in Google, type the name of that company or type the name of the promoter and addition to that, you can add some of the words like fraud, cases, litigation, unfair business practices, like this you can add some of the words and give search. So that you can easily find out like any fraud happened in that company or any cases filed against that company, like this news you can easily find out. In qualitative analysis, next what we have to check means whether that company management was punished by SEBI for doing insider trading like that we have to check. What is mean by insider trading means based on the company's confidential information if any management people buying or selling the shares in share market and they are getting profit means that is called as insider trading. Insider trading is completely illegal. If any company's high level management people did insider trading means for that SEBI will take strict action. For insider trading penalty will be very high. In Google, if you type the name of the company and addition to that, if you type insider trading cases, like this if you search means whether that company management got punishment for insider trading like that, full details you can easily get it from Google. At every financial year end, all the listed companies will publish annual report. In that annual report, that companies all the details will be mentioned. Like balance sheet, profit and loss account statement and cash flow statement and other details about the company and company's future projects also will be mentioned in annual report. One independent auditor will audit the company's record and after that only annual report will be published. In any company, at the mid of the financial year, if auditor resign his job means you should understand some big problem is there in that company like that you should understand. So if any company auditor resign in the middle, you should do the better analysis about that company. How to download one company's annual report means, for example, in Google, if you type LNT Limited Annual Report 2020 PDF, like this if you search means, you can easily download the annual report of that company. 
already we have seen the balance sheet profit and loss account statement and cash flow statement in the money control website but when compared to money control website in annual report detailed breakups will be given so for doing the better analysis you should download the annual report and using that annual report you can do the better analysis but one drawback is there in annual report that is in annual report only current year data and previous year data will be mentioned but in money control website current year data and last four years data will be mentioned this is one advantage in money control website for doing the qualitative analysis the very important chapter we have to check in annual report is management discussion and analysis from this chapter only we can easily understand the company's strategy and company's future project like this we can understand the company's capability in annual report of lnt limited management discussion and analysis chapter was mentioned in the page number 182 under the topic management discussion and analysis they had mentioned lnt limited's current projects like government hospital and medical college in bihar like this what are the current project lnt limited is working with we can find out from this topic next under the topic major order what are the major future projects lnt limited have in their hand like that they will mention for example international airport construction like this we can find the future projects of lnt limited if any infrastructure company have many future projects in their hand means then that is a positive sign for that company by this we can easily understand the capability of that company next if you scroll down the annual report there will be a topic named penalties or punishment or compounding of offenses like this one topic will be there under this topic if there is any pending cases against that company means that will be mentioned under this topic one company's top level management people like managing directors and other directors how much amount they are earning from this company as remuneration that details also we can check it from this annual report in annual report simply press control plus f and type managerial remuneration and press enter like this managing directors and other directors of lnt limiteds one year remuneration will be mentioned normally all the companies managing directors salary will be in crores lnt limiteds managing director sn subramanian's one year total remuneration was 27 crore rupees that is in 2020 his salary was 27 crore rupees like this other directors salary also will be mentioned suppose if any company is performing good means by that time you no need to worry about directors remuneration but if any company is not performing good and by that time if directors remuneration is very high means that is not a good sign at all because it shows that the company is not earning profit and director is least worried about that but he earns very high amount that is the meaning for that you can also check the company director's background education and previous experience by these details also you can do some qualitative analysis in qualitative analysis you can also check whether the company is giving importance to the minority shareholders during corporate action like that you can check if you like to be a long term investor then you go through the annual report very carefully so that you can easily understand the company's management strategy for doing qualitative analysis i cannot point out any parameters this is fully based on common sense only we had came to the end of fundamental analysis series please don't invest all your money in one single share at least select 10 good shares and please diversify your amount and invest in that 10 shares so that your investment amount will be safe in stock analysis both qualitative analysis and quantitative analysis both are very important if both analysis are satisfied then you do the investment in that company otherwise you don't invest in that company in our channel we have prepared totally 8 videos in the concept of basics of stock market please watch all those videos for understanding the basic terms in share market all the videos link are in description In this video if you have any doubt please make a comment i will reply thank you